You will learn in this video how you can import existing Azure resources into Terraform configuration files. Let's see how that works. So let's say here, for example, you have an existing Key Vault instance and you want to export it into a Terraform configuration. So all you need to do with this new Terraform import feature is that you define an import block where you specify your resource ID and then you specify the type of that resource. In my case here, it's a Key Vault instance. Then you run the command Terraform plan then you specify generate config out and then the name of the Terraform file that will be created and that will generate a new Terraform file that contains the configuration of your Azure Key Vault instance. And you can see an example here. Let's see a demonstration on how this works. But before that, let's go to understand first the history that led to creating this feature. You have already heard about the command Terraform import where you can specify your resource, the type of the resource, and then the resource ID. And then Terraform will go to import that resource, export it and import it into only a Terraform state file. It will not create a Terraform configuration for you. It's up to you to create it. So to be able to export that configuration into a Terraform file, not only the Terraform state, you can use open source tools like the Azure Terrafy command line, for example, or Terraformer, or there are lots of other resources that can help you. And by the way, I have created videos about these two tools that you can check it out in, to my, uh, from my YouTube channel, where I have also some other videos about Terraform, DevOps, and Azure. Let's now explore the Terraform import native feature to export this configuration. So for that, I have created a lab right here where I will show you the different steps that I gone through in order to import these resources. So here I have lots of imports for different resources that I have already created within my Azure subscription. I have created those resources manually. So I have here resource groups. I have uh, AKS clusters, container apps, app services, functions, storage accounts, key vaults, and so on. I, I want to try this tool onto the, all of these resources. So I want to export all of these resources into a Terraform configuration. What we need to do here is that we need to define first the providers that define the Azure RM and then within the main.tf file, we should provide this import block for each resource that we want to import or to export. And for each resource, we should specify its resource ID and then the type of that resource and the name of the Terraform resource that will be created. So I have done that for multiple resources, like for a resource group, for a key vault, for a key vault secret, for a virtual machine, app service plan, and many more. Let's see the results. So I need first to run the Terraform operation that will go to export those resources. And I can do that through the command Terraform plan. And then I specify here the uh, flag generate config out equal and then a name of a Terraform file that I'll call it here generated.tf. Let's run that command and let's give it a few seconds to complete the export of these resources. So you can see here it have done some magic behind this code. So you can see lots of errors because this at the end this tool is still in preview at the time being so we might expect some errors. But here we can see it succeeded already to export lots of uh, resources. Let's take a look at the result, which is the generated.tf file. So that generated 380 lines of Terraform code automatically for me. First resource is the resource group. And yes, it have the right location, the right name, the tags, and then the container app environment. It have the name, the location, and so on. And it seems to be correct for me. Then I have the app service plan already generated with all the configuration, which is the default configuration. And then it generated the virtual machine for me. And you can see also the container app that I have created. And note, of course, for this container app, it will not have a reference to the resource group. Instead, it will just write it in plain text. So you need to add some configuration or you need to uh, edit this file in order to make it perfect. And the same uh, thing, it will not uh, reference the container app environment using a Terraform reference. Instead, it will just put the uh, plain text for the, the resource ID. 
And this also works for, t for uh, AKS clusters. So here I did create an AKS cluster and a node pool that was exported with all the right configuration. And here I can see another resource exported that is Key Vault. But let's check for Key Vault as they have created a secret and give it a value for that secret. Let's uh, check if it did exported the value of the secret. So here is my secret and on the value it tells me equal null. And it tells me here that's a sensitive value. I will not show you that value. So this is very good in terms of security. It will not export the values of your secrets. Great. I hope this was helpful. Thank you.